yourself with a fist punch up your ass today at the present moment. Hey, your mind's interesting ways to manifest. Most nights I watch footage of 9-11 while I get wrecked. Here's a clip. I get a song that's blowing up, I'm threatening to bomb my own fans, but I, I got all these t-shirts. <laughs> Who wants one? <laughs> I'm assuming that I didn't pass a troll test. It's nothing new, fuck you, fuck this. The more who turn their backs, the more targets I have. The more places to stamp, the more ass to grab. I get a warmer response if I piss my own pants. I went to go see my tattoo artist today. Consultation, make the next appointment and everything. And his new shop is freaking awesome. So it's a speakeasy. So you walk in, it looks like this little corner store, and you go up to the vending machine in there, and then you hit a certain button, the vending machine opens up, and it's the doorway to the tattoo shop. I'm off the wagon, ditching a dead end road. I'll put that tip money back. I'm done. Woke up this morning and came outside to all this shit. The fuck? My, my puppy fell in the trash compactor! Turn off the machine! <laughs> Just imagining a real puppy in a trash compactor. He came up to me today. He goes, I'm gonna ask the boss if we can get some pizza today. My wife said she's making cabbage and cornbread. I told her I don't want none of that bullshit. <laughs> My body will fall apart at some point, but hopefully I'll be dead and or famous before that happens. But you never know. Big ass titties. down from heaven to ruin my fucking life. Well, they broke this slicer, so now I gotta use the meat slicer to make scalloped potatoes. And... Eesh. It's fine. I'll lose a finger. It's fine. Sad? Yes. Also, alarming. And, but also, funny. To the unfit for society. Uh huh? Millennials and under, we're fucked, right? We're the first generation that's gonna do worse than our parents statistically, you know what I mean? Which sucks, but the worst part is that our parents think it was because they were so smart. You know what I mean? That I can't stand that. I'm tired of hearing it from baby boomers, right? Like their lives were so easy. You could just win a house at a carnival back then, you know what I mean? Just some guy like... Oh, oh nice. A three-bedroom. Awesome. Honey, we're moving again. <laughs> yeah, have you ever tried to get advice from them about a job? They're like, well, did you look him in the eye and shake his hand? And it's like, yeah, I did that. And I'm like, oh, well, that's how I became the vice president of Circuit City. So I'm, uh, I'm out of ideas. <laughs> they all think we're children, dude. These millennials spending all their money on lollipops. It's like, okay, I need a CPAP machine, actually. But... And these lollipops have weed in them, by the way. So a little more expensive than you might think. Uh, yeah, sucks. They ruined the world. Global warming, that's them, right? Not for anything good, either. I think it was mostly hairspray, right? That's it. Like, every Bon Jovi concert took a centimeter off the polar ice caps, I'm pretty sure. Like, oh, I, now I have to fucking wash my yogurt cups? Why? Why? 
You wanted a jerry curl, so I have to rinse out garbage now? How is that fair? <laughs> they ruined drunk driving. That was them, right? <laughs> Come on. You know how fun that would be right now? You know what I'm saying? Fucking get on one of those electric scooters for truly steep. That would be sick. I think that the last eight years, eight years in this country has really ruined the whole the president's been kidnapped genre of action movie. I will say that it has deflated my enthusiasm. That, that was a fun movie 10 years ago. That was fun. Oh, you'd go, you'd go right to the cinema on Friday. The president's been kidnapped. Oh, no, who's going to save him? Channing Tatum? I hope his shirt doesn't come off. We were all... We were excited for those. You can't make that movie now. That movie does not have the steam it once held. The president's been kidnapped. Well, yeah, I mean... It's not good out there. People aren't happy, man. 